Hello, I'm Max Barry, a creator of Nation States, and I decided to do a video Q&A today, so I would answer the most common questions that come up about Nation States. So, number one, why did I make this? Uh, I made Nation States uh, 10 years ago, a long time ago now, um, because I was working on a book called Jennifer Government, um, which is a political satire um, of ultra-libertarianism. Uh, and when I was researching this book, I had come across a few different sites, but one in particular, where, which is the Political Compass site, where you answer a few questions about your um, how you would deal with hypothetical situations, and then it comes up with this answer, like, uh, you are a communist. It categorizes you. Um, not that I got communist. I got... I got socialist. No, I didn't get socialist. Um, I got uh, I got inoffensive centrist democracy or whatever the equivalent was. But um, so I I thought that was really cool. But it would be good if I could make a site where you could carry on with that. You could see how your country would look if it was actually based on your political ideals. So I I knew how to program a little bit, um, taught myself a bit more, and fooled around with code until I had. Um, kind of a game uh, and it was only a tiny small bit of the site that we have today but it was enough that you could go and you could build your own country uh, and I didn't expect it to be very popular I thought if I could get a thousand people playing it then that would be enough to justify this time I was spending fooling around making computer games instead of writing novels like I was supposed to do but um, uh, I, clearly I underestimated how many people think it's pretty fun to create your own country uh, and so we now have like over three million uh, nations ever created. Uh, question two, uh, most popular question, why are you Australian? Uh, well, uh, someone has to be. It, it, there are a number of us who, who just turn out that way uh, and that's just the way it goes. Uh, number three, uh, most popular question is um, how can you call this a game when there's not really very much to do? Are you planning on adding some kind of feature that would make this supposed game uh, slightly more game-like? Uh, because I get into the game, I answer an issue, and then I'm like, I'm like what do I do? Uh, so fair enough. Uh, I understand this question. And um, someone described nation-states as, as Facebook for nations, uh, which, which I thought was, was kind of right. Uh, yeah, there, is, there are a lot of different um, parts of the site where... There are different kind of games that have sprung up on their own. There's like a region crashing game, an invasion game. Um, there are role-playing games. There's all sorts of new aspects of the site that, that grew up out of this very basic foundation that I laid down. Uh, so there are things to do, but um, it, is, it is an unusual site in that most people who, who visit it, they, they sort of enter the game and they find themselves at a bit of a loss. So, so on the one hand, I would like there to be not such a sense of what do I do next in this site? But on the other hand, I think it's kind of part of the charm that you build this nation and then, and then if it goes no further, then, then that's fine. You just kind of sort of potter around with your nation. Um, and if you want to find other parts of the site that, uh, that have more uh, elements to them, then you can do that as well. Uh, question number four, will there be a nation states too? Well, there was a nation states too. Um, it, it didn't go well. It was, it was very bad. Um, what happened is I had had plans to do this for a long time, but, you know, I, to develop a game is kind of a big deal. You need resources to do that. So um, there was a, a games company that said, hey, we'll, we'll build Nation States too. You give us the spec and, and we'll go off and do it. Uh, and then, and then things, things got a bit messy. Um, they, they basically built half the game and said, well, let's, let's release that as a beta. Uh, and I was like, well, yeah, it doesn't really seem like much is there at the moment. But they were like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah we'll keep building it. And then, but for now, we'll just sort of let the players in to see it being built. So I, I said, okay. Um, but, but then no more building happened. Uh, the game just sort of sat there in this uh, beta state. And it didn't seem like anything else was going to happen. So, um, yeah, it, it ended up getting shut down because I wouldn't sign off on the final um, product being final uh, and but it all worked out because I managed to get nation states back under my own control and I think we've been adding um, good features uh, and improving the site fairly steadily over the last uh, three or four years uh, since that happened uh, most popular question number five uh, are you violet uh, well no I'm I'm like a pasty white vampiric I don't understand that question um, so that's it uh, oh oh one bonus question uh, is it true you are an author with a new book out? Um, that question is from uh, Max Barry. Well, thank you, Max. Uh, yeah, look, I, 
I am an author. Uh, I write books for my day job, uh, and this is how I basically support myself. So I have a new book out called Lexicon, uh, which is in all good bookstores right now in the US, Canada, Australia, New Zealand, the UK, uh, and other countries. Uh, it's gotten great reviews. It's got four and a half stars on Amazon, I think. It's four point something on Goodreads. Uh, I, I'm really proud of it as a book. If you like nation states, then please do check it out on maxbarry.com or, or Amazon or wherever you like to find good things to read. Um, Either way, uh, thank you for playing Nation States. Thanks for being a part of this awesome site. Uh, and until next time, may all your nations be good nations. Unless you want to make bad ones just on purpose to you know, see how that turns out. <laughs>